Hello everyone. Today I will help you to look uh, our any I mean, our particle animation. So the key of looking our particle animation is our first frame and last frame have to be same. So what we can do? Yes, we can duplicate our particle layer. Go to the next frame and make a mark, and make a marker here. And move to the first frame. Yes, move our layer to the first frame. So now we have the first frame and last frame it is same. But our second layer is a particle, so it still burn particle more and more. So in the last frame it has its own particle. So that we have to keyframe our particle per second parameter in our second layer. Yeah, it's here particle per yes, frame is and then the next frame we set it to zero now our now our first frame and our last frame is the same and our loop animation is perfect so you, you can see that our particle animation is looking perfectly but the problem is that when we want to change when we want to change some parameter of our particle we have to change twice because now we have two particles, two layer particles. So we have to change two of them twice, or we change one of them and then we make in the loop again. Yes, that's our problem. So we will not loop our particle in that way. We will do it in another way. We will use our particle to particle com to create new com. Oh, it's a looping loop. Now we have our our layer, our uh, com. We have our particle com here. So what time we want to look? Uh, yes, we want it about six seconds. Okay, we want it about six seconds. We go to our particle. Go to our particle com and go to the particle layer and keyframe the particle per second. At the right, at the time, we have yes, we have to keyframe it at the time we want to look in the six second. Yeah, we go to the six second and keyframe to zero. Okay, and then we duplicate the layer and mark, uh, marker here and like move it back to the first frame. Yes, now our looking is perfectly. We want to change some parameter of our particle. Yes, we can. We just we just go to our particle com and change whatever we, whatever we want. So when you look to that, you have to just if our second layer if the particle in our second layer die before our loop looping time, if they still alive, we will do another step. And then we change the two seconds to find it zero down. If we get the layer uh, my, um, marker and move back to the next first frame. Now we can see our particle is still alive. Yes. So, if you it, it's not looking. Yes, you can see it's not looking. Yes. So, when our particle not, our particle, yes, it's not looking a little rough here. When our, our second particle is not dying on, we have to duplicate again and go to the next frame, make a marker and move it back to the first frame. Yes, we will do it until our uh, our last duplicate particle is dying. It die all. 
so we can see now all vertical is died. Yes, now our vertical will look perfectly again. Yeah, you can see that. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.